stop supporting transactions and clients. All right, guys, well, we still have an hour and a half left in the road trip. Welcome back to the channel. Today, we got a really special video coming for you. We are heading to Blue Jack National, Tiger Woods' course, and this place is unreal. Today's video, I'm gonna try and highlight the entire course for you guys. The facility, everything that goes along with it, it's gonna be a wild day. You guys may have already seen the course on GM Golf, but we're gonna dive a little bit deeper into it. I'm gonna play the Tiger Tees, 18 holes. It's just gonna be a special day. So let's get back on the road here. Gotta get some gas. And We'll get there very shortly. We currently have like 30 minutes left um, until we get to the course, but I'm gonna show you what it looks like driving up to Blue Jack because it's something special. Um, I've noticed this with a lot of private courses. They're always hidden, very exclusive. Like you know, you don't have no idea that it's even there. So we're gonna be going out to like some farmland, cows everywhere. Like you would just never expect it to be there. It's hidden back in there. I'll give you a quick little tour of what that looks like coming up here. All righty, here we go. Let's head down to the course now, guys. You park the cars up here, and then the course you have to drive down to. It's kind of a cool little setup. This place is, I'm just gonna keep saying it all day. It's special, look at this range. I mean, you got like bullseye targets out there. Oh, being in that car, we had a three and a half hour drive. Being in that car, I am so tight right now. My warm-up session today is going to be super brief. Uh, I'm just trying to get loose, but we're heading to the tee pretty soon. But I also want to show you guys right before we head out, there's a little par three course area over there. I might have to show you guys it after the round. It's unreal. Yeah, just trying to get loose. Well, this is their logo. It's a little acorn. Um, look, they got their little, they got four balls here sitting. I feel bad like even breaking them. It's going to take two. Hit a couple practice putts. This practice green, I mean, Look at this thing. This place is just crazy. In my eyes, like a golfer's complete paradise. It's quiet out here. It's just, it's unreal. All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the two o'clock starting time of Blue Jack National. First on the tee box, playing out of Jupiter, Florida, Mr. Grant Horvath. Good, left side. Oh. Woo! That's money. Got me a little close, but hey, I, I no, made the hole good, a little bro. shorter. There we go, left side of the fairway. Hey, thank you, man, I appreciate it. Yeah, absolutely. Also, real quick, shout out to Tommy, the starter. Super, super nice guy. He does that like for almost every group out here, I'm pretty sure. He like actually starts them off, which is just crazy. Now, there's not many courses in the world where you get up on the first tee and they announce your name and he says it in a very, you know. Very enthusiastic. Yeah, very enthusiastic way. He's a nice guy. It's just shout out to Tommy. Oh my gosh, this is literally nuts. It's like there's so much green grass. I feel bad driving on this grass. I know. So I perfect. literally, look at this, guys. When I, when I was coming out to film here, I talked with one of the guys that uh, manages this course, and he said that Tiger made this course very nice and open off the tee but the greens are super hard that's the defense he wanted the pace of play to be nice and fast and so he made the fairways a little bit wider that's what he told me all right guys 131 to the pin here i got a pitching wedge probably hit a 50 actually let me actually hit a 50. back in the stamp a little bit lower bring it in there low there we go well I really like, when I got over that, since I went from the pitch and wedge to the 50, I tried to swing a little bit harder at that. All good though, probably gonna have to get up and down now. One thing I noticed right away is there's no fringe. There's literally no fringe. So it just goes from like this nice thin grass you could literally sleep on straight to the green. This one's tough. We gotta just land it on there, we're gonna let it roll out. There's no way. I think I caught like a little, it almost looked like a little sand spot. Like I caught it and the sand came up right when it landed. It kind of killed it. First putt of the day and it's about 15 feet for par, maybe even 20 feet. Oh. Hmm. 
Oh, a little bogey there to start the day. But the second hole, I played out here once or twice. It's been a while. The second hole is a gettable par five. So let's bounce back with birdie. Gosh, after that drive, only having 130 yards in, that's just unfortunate to bogey there. But it happens, first hole of the day, for one over through one. All right, on to our second hole of the day, 563 yards from the Tiger Tees here. She's a beast. I usually go in this bunker on the left, so I gotta try and keep it just a little right of it. No, carry, carry the bunker, carry the bunker. Oh. <laughs> I literally go in that bunker every time I play here. Every single time, and that was bombed. It just needed to be like five more yards to the right. Oh, Tiger. Tiger, you little, you did it to me. All right, guys, we got 2.30 to the pin. This is literally the same spot I've been every single time. I'm going to hit a six iron. I feel like that's the safest club here just to get it over this lip. Oh yeah. Here we go guys, 52 yards to this pin. I gotta go over this bunker. I gotta carry it 50. I gotta almost carry it the number. I don't think I have tons of green to work with here. I got a 60 degree. Down, 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 down. Woo, well, I didn't go short. Did not go short there. That is long. It looks like we're on the, the fringe here technically, but I mean, it, it doesn't even look like the fringe. It looks just like the green, so. Here we go, left to right here. Treat it nice. Down. Woo, -hoo. that one was fast. That one was fast. Here we go, got some work. Maybe a little right to left here. Dude. Oh, baby. You hate to see it, guys. You really do. You hate to see it, but it's only up from here. Bogey, bogey start. Two over through two. Bogey a par five there. Whew, that's frustrating. That really, that is frustrating right there. But we're going to turn around. All right, guys. On to the third hole here. 230 yards. That's going to be long. I'm going to try and hit a low stinger four iron. Get it to roll all the way back there. We're going to have to, we're going to have to pick it up. I know one thing, this course is not just gonna hand three strokes out there. I mean, that par five was very gettable, but to bogey it, it's not good. Hit there. No! That was it. That was it. Oh, Tiger. You make it hard, man. You make it really tough. I feel like Tiger made those tees for him to come out here to like prepare for a tournament, like for a really hard course, because man, oh, 570 par four to start and now this, 230. I think it's gonna get really interesting as the day goes on. Doesn't look like too many people have been in this bunker today. It's very, it's very nice and raked. I love bunker shots though. So here we go, we're pin high here. Let's see if we can get this up and down. The bogey train is like, I don't know. It's one of those trains you just, you want to get off as fast as you can. You don't feel comfortable on it. But, but it's also one of those those trains when, when you get on, like you just can't get off. They, they like they trap you on it, you know? Whew. All right, we made it. We made it, we made it. We snuck it in the right side. Whew. Okay, I, it's crazy, I par. Probably the, one of the hardest holes on the entire course right there. A 230 yard par three. But we're two over now through three holes. I'll tell you right now, guys, I feel great with my swing. My putting feels solid. Everything feels good. So I don't know. It's just, it's one of those days. Some days I, when I have a bad range session, I'm not making putts. I, I don't feel confident that I can bring it back. But today it's just, I'm staying calm. All right, guys, fourth hole of the day here. Um, 474 yards into the wind. It's gonna be fun. It's gonna be really fun here. Probably gonna have a long iron in, so let's hit a good drive. All right. Down the right side of the fairway. 
Not bad. Not great. 198 to the pin. The problem is we have a tree on our right here. I'm going to have to almost hit a low cut, which not my specialty, but I think we can pull it off. Five iron, low cut, 200 yards. Oh, be good. Just left your thing. Jump up. <laughs> oh, baby. Come on. Come on. Let's make that birdie putt. Well, let's get back to one over. Here we go. Straight up the hill. A little left to right. Oh. Such a weak, weak effort there. Really weak effort. After a spectacular shot. At me. All good, guys. We're two over through four holes. On to our fifth hole here. This one, this one's special. Another par five, so let's birdie it. All right, guys. On to our fifth hole of the day. 582 yard par five. We can get there in two. Let's bomb this drive. Let's hit a three wood or hybrid on the green. Down the right side, over top of that tree. All right. Down the right side, you probably didn't see that one. Yeah, that was that was a little bit down the right side there. Should be in the right center of the fairway. Not too bad. 270 yards here, guys. This is my line. It's kind of sitting up a little bit um, in the rough here, but I just I think this is going to grab my club. I don't know if I can really get this there. I'm going to try my best. See what happens. Oh, come on. Just go. Just go. 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 That's the best possible scenario right there. We were just short, up and down for the birdie. Let's get it back. It's like a 30 yard shot here, but I'm gonna take it super low. There's a giant ridge in the middle of the green. The pin's all the way in the back. I'm gonna let it ride this ridge. Well, didn't play it far enough right. Oh, it went down the hill. I maybe should have putted that. Maybe. I'm not even going to take the pin out. We're just going to react to this target. Here we go. A little left to right. Go right. Oh. Well, a little frustrating there. Being so close to the green. I mean, looking back at that, I really should have hit like a pitching wedge or a nine iron even and get it rolling because that sand wedge, it kind of checked up. So that's a mental note. I know now when you have that much green to work with, it's kind of, you shouldn't really take a 56 degree. And I did that and that's why I came up with short. But yeah, we're gonna head over to this little halfway house now. We'll maybe take a video inside of it. There's so much food, like it's crazy. All right, here we go. This has to be one of the coolest things about Blue Jack National, this little snack shop. Look at this, they got this. But I mean to tell you, <laughs> Crazy. They got it all. Literally, you got your ice cream, you got yeah, anything you want. Damage. You can do some damage. Lady's gonna go buy about everything here. Yeah, she's gonna eat everything. Also, real quick, there's Tiger Woods designing the course before it was made. Unreal. Really cool photos. All right, here we go. Hole number six, 454, par four. Golf is just so frustrating when you don't take advantage, but at the end of the day, I'm here. Just enjoy this course. It, it's like, it's a funny thing. It's like, there's a pool. You want to play good, but you also want to enjoy this experience because you don't get many of these. So, happy I can showcase this with you guys. Right down the middle. There's a good drive. Caught it low on the face. I caught it down here. We're still gonna probably have like an eight or a seven iron in. Prime position, center of the fairway. 172 to the pin. It's go time. Here we go. Sit there. Perfect. Perfect little shot there. Let's go on the green. I'd rather just hit it awful and just play bad and do it all at once. But when you're hitting it good, and I'm hitting good tee shots, I'm, it's just frustrating when you're over par. All right, guys, here we go. Straight down the hill, left to right. It's gonna be super, super fast. How 
Oh, is that low still? There's no way. Holy moly, these are tough greens. Wow. I felt like I just played so much break there. It's crazy. Tiger, tiger, tiger. Tiger is watching me right now and he's laughing. No? He's just laughing. He's thinking this is hilarious. Right, that takes me to three over now through six holes from the Tiger Tees. Boy, it's tough. It is, it's a tough one. All right, guys, I just shot it 131 yards to the pin here. That's a little bit more of a reasonable hole. We gotta bounce back now. That's a three putt there. Wow, that was just tough, that was tough. Let's knock this little eight iron down. There's a good breeze up there, just a three quarter swing. Oh, be good. No, bro! Oh my goodness, that flew right over top of the pin. I thought that was so good. I bet, I bet this up and down is gonna be tricky. When I was on the range warming up today, before I, before I headed out here, I told a couple guys on the range, they asked, what tees are you playing? And I said, I'm gonna play the Tiger tees. And they looked at me like I was crazy. And I was like, I gotta do it. I gotta see what I can shoot. Now I'm starting to, I'm starting to realize what they were talking about. That right there, obviously no excuse, 130 yards, but it is just, the greens is where it really gets you. It's not the tee shot. I almost got, I got, almost got to hit a flop shot here. I gotta go high with that. Go, 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 go. There we go, finally. There's a good chip. That one rolled out. It did not check up, it actually rolled. There we go. I think we got this one. We got about two and a half, three feet. We did it. We made par. What a, what a round it's been. Three over through seven now. Two more to go on this nine. Um, this next hole, I believe, is a drivable par four, so I can maybe get this on the green. All right, guys. This hole from right here is 318. The Tiger Tee is right there. Um, I'm going to play one up because I don't think I can get it back there. It's 330. I think 318 here gives me a little bit better of a chance. Um, this is one hole I want to play a little bit up. I just I want to get after it. I want to get after this green, and I... This should be the perfect yardage. There's a guy spraying water on the green. I, I hope, yeah, if it's going towards him, I'm gonna yell. Pretty sure he's probably used to a lot of balls flying past his face, so. Here we go, left side of the green. I know one thing, if you miss it to the right, it funnels down to the right, so you gotta keep it down the left side. No, it's at that tree. I think it hit it. Did you? It was just at that giant tree. I just pulled it just a hair. It'd be a little right of that. I think we'll be okay though. Let's take a look at this. Collect our data. 85 yards. I gotta say real quick. These are amazing, these little Reese's things. I don't know about you guys, but one of my favorite. Peanut butter just. Immaculate. Just does things to you. I like a, a low 56. Gotta keep it under this tree. Landed about 65. <laughs> okay, I can assure you guys I did not land that 65 yards. I carried that pin high. Wow, but that worked out. It spun a ton. I nipped that. That was not what I was trying to do, but we got a good birdie luck. Kind of been long all day. I've been long and short all day, actually. I can't even say I've been long all day because I've hit a lot of chip shots that have been short. So I'm going back and forth like tennis. But right to left, down the hill, it's going to be fast. Bro. All right, well, on to the ninth hole. We're birdie free. That is not something you like to say. I mean, bogey free is a great one. Birdie free is, that one hurts to say. On to our ninth hole. Let's see if we can birdie this. And we have nine more to go from the Tiger Tees. So guys, stay tuned. I'm gonna upload the next nine holes in a couple days. It's gonna be interesting. I just, honestly, at this point, I wanna break 75. I'm three over now. I think I can come in at even and break 75 from the Tiger Tees. Well, here we go, 492, that, that's a beast. And the thing is from these tees, this tree is right here in my way. And like, if you play the tees up, the normal set of tees, you don't even have to deal with that, but 
once again, that's probably what he designed. He wanted that to be very demanding off the tee just to, to get dialed for tournaments. Down the middle. Go, go, go. Run. Run, run, run. Not my best. That was a, I mean, that was a pretty big old draw there. I hit that way off the toe. Um, but that barely missed that giant tree right there on the right. 188 to the pin, uphill. I'm going to go with a 7-iron. I'm going to put it back in my stance, try and roll one up there. to a nice little low stinger almost. Oh, be good. Be good. That's all I got. That's all I got. Please, let's make a birdie. Let's get to two over. Come on. I'm begging. I'm begging at this point. It's that hard. All right, here we go. Well, a lot closer than I thought. I landed right there, rolled right to pin high. We finally, we finally controlled our distance today. This is like the first time I've been pin high, really all day, other than that birdie putt I missed. Bro. Oh. The lippy, the lippy Madu. Tiger. No, that, and that's not Tiger's fault. That's just, <laughs> guys, let's grind. Absolute grind. That that was such a good look there. But hopefully you guys did enjoy this video. Hopefully you guys got to see a really good view of this course because I don't think many people have filmed out here. So yeah, it's just it's been an absolute treat. Shout out to Blue Jack National for having me out here. We're gonna head on to our back nine. We're three over. We're gonna be okay. If you guys did enjoy that, let me know in the comments. But until next time, peace out.